After defeating Justine Hennen, Venus became Wimbledon champion for the second year running. But today Venus was even close to, I think she's played about 57, 55% of the way she can play. I feel very good. Venus has just won her second uh, uh, Wimbledon in a row. And I was wondering how would I feel if she did that. I don't know how I feel. I felt like taking a lot of damn pitches. So I ended up shooting about 18 rows of films at 36 exposure per film. And maybe when I uh, develop the film, maybe I might learn how I feel. But right now I'm very excited for Venus and the Williams family and so on. I think Venus is very excited to win a second Wimbledon in a row. And hopefully that it would last for Venus to go over through the US Open. Richard decides to leave the limelight to Venus to glow as the press and public vie for her attention. He walks back to their rented house nearby to reflect on the day's great victory. So yesterday she was trying to read books, do some homework and so on. And today Venus went out there and played and gosh, I feel great about it. Moments later, Richard has an unexpected visitor. Missing her father, Venus decides to return home early. Thank you, you did very good. Thank you, Dave. You had a great match. I'm very proud of you. You did very well. And you are to be commended. Thank you, Dave. Very good. Two in a row. <laughs> How did you feel? Feel good. All right. Mm -hmm. Do Bobby know you won? Oh, no, I don't think he knows. Oh, you got to call Bobby and let Bobby know you won. Yeah. Yeah. Poor Bob. Poor Bob. Bob is a great pet doggy. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Venus, have you talked to Serena? Does mm. Serena know you want? No, I haven't talked to her. Oh, great. Well, thank you very much, and I hope you have a good evening. Thank you, Danny. Thank you, Venus. Very good. Two in a row. I like to win Wimbledon as many times as anyone else could win it. More than any woman, man, or any junior did. What, what about the other tournaments? I get a grand slam. <laughs>